little bit naughty. I'm a little bit too consumed. But playing the ice cream. <laughs> Three avocados. <laughs> <laughs> You're a little bit crazy. It's been days, but you never change. What's love got to do with it? He comes around, but I'm not that stuck down. Come a little bit closer. Yeah, yeah. Come a little bit closer. Yeah. Oh, my lady. Oh, my God. Put your finger right in his face and tell that man bye bye. I'm too. Selfish, you get mad every time you lose. You can't take me with you. I'm scared you're gonna blow your fuse. Come a little bit closer. Yeah, I can really start over. Work it Sundays in the back of my mind. There's someone waiting on me. You're just wasting my time because you're scared and only finally got some closure. Yeah, I can finally start all over. Oh, wow. Yeah, to so all my ladies who got a brother that doesn't treat them right, put your finger right in his face and tell that man bye bye. I'm too fly. I'm too fly. I'm about to film a spring outfits video and now to change into them. I'm so lazy. Yes. Wow. Oh, your meat rice, good idea. <laughs> guacamole stand from the Guacamole Master. What are these called? These are the lemon pepper chicken wings. <laughs> Whoa. Just a little bit more. Wow. Lemon pepper air fried chicken wings. We found this recipe on YouTube. This is the dry rub. We coated them in a thin layer of flour and popped them in the air fryer for 24 minutes. Then we flipped them halfway through, coated them in a butter and lemon pepper seasoning. Cheers. Cheers to your mama. Cheers. Wow. Mm. <laughs> Good. Yo, the chicken is still crispy. <laughs> You're so dumb. <laughs> 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 oh, God. Okay, look, I'm about to watch Oh, my God. It's first trip. Oh, keep up with us on the next vlog. Ah. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wow, that lighting. <laughs> <laughs>
guys happy? Yes. You still are, haven't drinking yours yet? I'm making a TikTok. Oh my God. <laughs> Just normal vlog, say hi. <laughs> dropped off my sister and her boyfriend last night. They're staying with us for a week. Sorry if the vlog did not have a whole lot of chatting. We honestly were just having so much fun some days. I was like, shoot, I'm filming a vlog. <laughs> my sister is 19. I'm sure you've seen her on my channel a couple times, but her and I are super close. So it's always nice when she's able to fly in and stay with me. So I really dropped all of my work and played mom for a week and drove them around everywhere. We did all the fun things. It was a lot of fun, but now I am ready to get back into work. Today is actually Sunday, so it's gonna be around almost 80 degrees today. We're staying in Malibu, and Brent and I are actually about to go play tennis shortly. We're just gonna play for an hour or so, and then my girlfriend Rachel is coming over here. We're gonna have a little beach day. But yeah, it was a good little break, so I will see you guys later. The other day went to the Bellows flea market and picked up a few things. I didn't really buy a whole lot. I feel like we did so much this entire week that honestly I don't even remember what we did anymore. This is one of the shirts that Brandon picked up. It's just like a plain white graphic tee. We love graphic tees. Flea markets are the best places to get them just because you can get such cool graphic tees for like so cheap. And then a couple of days after the Melrose Flea, we actually ended up going to Due Date Studios, which is actually one of Brandon's friends, like little vintage shop. So he also sells a lot of like cool vintage bags, shoes. He has a lot of like cool Nike uh, dunks and like Jordans and stuff like that and he also has a lot of really cool vintage tees. We picked up like 10 tees from him between me, Brandon, Eric, and my sister. We just picked up so many things. We just love his selection of stuff and this is one of the shirts that Brandon picked up. It has like an eagle on it. It's super like washed and faded which makes it look really vintage and cool and it also has a little back graphic as well so that is really cute. These are all the shirts that I got, I had them folded really nicely, but I'll go ahead and show you guys what I got. I'm actually really excited about this. This is like a race car tee, especially if you are into like vintage graphic tees, but you don't want to wear like a band that you don't listen to and then have to deal with all that. Some people are really haters, but hey, I think race car shirts are actually really cool. Really oversized white race car tee. It has a really cool graphic and then the back also has a really big graphic as well. This is actually a shirt that Brandon picked up for me. It says Ride with Pride. It has a big giant eagle on it. I don't know if I would normally wear something like this, but I feel like it is super 
cool and edgy. I just think it's cute when Brandon picks out tees for me. This is another one that I picked up. Shout out to my girlfriend Jenny. She is one of my friends back in Seattle. She's obsessed with dolphins. Maybe I'll keep it wearing a couple times, but maybe I'll give it to her as well. And then this is the last shirt that I picked up. It's kind of plainer in the front. It says Stealth Fighter, so it has a little like jet situation on it. And then the back graphic is my favorite part. It just looks super cool. There's like a spaceship mountain moon situation. I don't even really know what it is, but it just looks cool. And I like that it's so big, all cool graphics. And we got them each for like 20 to $30, which is amazing. So that's my little thrift haul. Just got back from the beach. I showered and it was super nice out today. Rachel and I took little nappies and had so much fruit. I have my matcha made. I'm actually trying out new matcha today. You guys know I love my Tenzo matcha, but I'm trying out the Alfred matcha and it's pretty good. This place is where I normally buy my raw boba and whenever I make boba at home. Tried it out and it's just as good as my Tenzo, but I'd rather just get my matcha from Tenzo because I have a discount code from there. So if you guys want to, Use my code, Tenzo's my favorite. My routine is always wake up, make matcha, and then I'll brush my teeth, do my skincare, all that good stuff. So I already applied my skincare routine. I actually have to film a video later today with Sephora that you guys will see shortly. My skin has been looking really good, which is always super nice. It recently has been breaking out a little bit. I don't know if you can tell. I have a little bit of texture Right now, sometimes my skin has really weird freakouts. I don't know if you can see in my hairline, there's like little red bumps. I need to go see a dermatologist about it because I'm pretty sure I start getting like hives or breakout from either the shampoo that I use, dry shampoo, maybe from not washing out my shampoo thoroughly. Like maybe I have some residue left in my hair, but it's been making me break out and I get these tiny little bumps up in my hairline and it slowly creeps down into my forehead. I'll post some pictures of what it looks like, but it looks horrible. This has been the only thing that has been helping me. This is actually Nizoro anti-dandruff uh, anti shampoo. I heard about it on TikTok and Skincare by Hiram, and it's supposed to be really good for fungal acne. I think the situation that happens from time to time for me is either dermatitis or some sort of bacterial situations. If I'm showering, I'll go ahead and use this as like shampoo over my entire head and then bring it down to my forehead because I don't really break out on the rest of my face. It's mainly on my like scalp and forehead situation. So I'll really focus this all along my scalp on my forehead and then I'll rub it in for like a minute and then just let it sit while I like wash my face or wash my body or whatever. And this has been helping so much. It goes away like the next day. If you guys have had a similar experience, let me know because that would be super helpful. I need my face to be looking right, okay? Anyways, I need to finish up my skincare routine, but I am gonna go ahead and apply my sunscreen. I've been really liking this one. I feel like I've been talking about it a lot. This is the Polish Choice Youth Extending Daily Hydrating Fluid. And then of course, I'm gonna do my two finger roll. Brandon's actually gonna be here shortly. I love that sunscreen so much. Two finger roll really did not show up at all. It just feels like a super hydrating moisturizer that also contains SPF, which is always great. So I get my skin protection, no white cast at all. We are staying in Malibu, like I said, because my sister and her boyfriend was visiting us. It's just nice because there's so many extra bedrooms here that we can stay. Our house is super small. It's just a two bedroom and we live with Brandon's grandma. This is his parents' house and it's always super nice that they allow us to do that. Brandon and I actually, want to buy our own house this year. We're kind of looking here and there, so if we find anything that we absolutely fall in love with, we are gonna go ahead and buy it. And I'm so excited for this next step in our life just to be able to have a house and with empty rooms and have my own studio and office that I could film in. I'm excited. Hey, baby. Look at the good boys. Oh, careful. You must fail. It is the nicest day outside today. My sister actually called me because we dropped her and her boyfriend off last night at the airport and they're back in Seattle already. And it's raining and cold and I do not envy that at all. So anyways, my slippers are actually outside over there because 
Yesterday we filmed the TikTok with the kids. It's a new like TikTok trend that's going on. So I'll go ahead and pop it up on the screen. I jumped in the pool fully clothed with my slippers on and now they are sopping wet in like chlorine water. So they've been outside drying for the last few days. Anyways, need to get back to work, but I hope you guys enjoyed this fun little vlog. It's always nice to have my sister come visit and I love her to death. The weather was also nice while she was here. So it's nice that she was able to get that break before she went back to Seattle weather and all that stuff. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Make sure to thumbs up if you do enjoy so i know you want to see more vlogs from me that is all i'll see you all next time bye